Hi everyone, this is Crafty Decoria and I hope you're all doing great. So I've jumped on here for a quick Dollar Tree haul. It's been a while. I have really not been going all that much. The last few times that I went, I didn't really see anything that had caught my eye or that I hadn't seen before. So I did happen to go today and I did find some new items that I was excited about. So I did bring some of them home with me. Again, at the end, I have a few pictures of some other things that I did take while I was there. So if I remember, I will insert them at the end of this video. So without further ado, here is an overview of the things that I did pick up. I will go through them one by one so that you can have a better look. I hope you enjoy. Okay, so as soon as I walked into the Dollar Tree, this is the first thing that I saw, and there wasn't very many left of these. I actually, not too long ago, was looking for something like this, but the only ones that I was finding were the smaller size um, wallet defend card holders, and the Dollar Tree does carry those as well, but they were just too small. So this one here is a really nice size. You can see how large it is. There's my hand and it goes down to about here. And it says that it holds up to 18 cards, which is great. So you can see here's a picture. You can place money on this side like bills. And then here there's a zipper and then you can place cards here. So this was a super nice find. So it is called a Wallet Defend card holder, helps protect identity and card information. And the name is the Valencia Collection Elegance. So if I turn it over to the back, there you can see a, another picture of it. Really nice. And so it does fold down to a more compact size. And if I go closely here, you can see that it says $19.99 on the back of the packaging. So this was a super nice find. Next, just beside those wallets, I ended up finding these. And these are driveway markers. They are 48 inches or 122 centimeters and they are by Toolbench. And this was a really neat find. About in the fall, uh, my sister-in-law was actually looking for these um, driveway markers for her driveway and we had gone to the home hardware and they were quite pricey. So um, to find these at the Dollar Tree was a terrific, terrific find. I don't know if she needs them. If I remember, I will let her know so that if she's still looking out for these, to pick these up for $1.25 a piece is a fantastic find. I went down the sock aisle and I ended up coming across these really nice socks that I came to find are were actually from Sears. And I can see that they did um, originally had them priced at around $5.99, but then they marked them down a few times. And the last price that is cr crossed out is $3.97. So I thought these were a really nice find. The quality of these is super nice. And I only saw them in this owl print, but I did pick up a couple pairs because I thought they were just too cute. And the owl is wearing these silver glittery glasses. I thought that was adorable. And then while I was there, I noticed that they had some new instant shoe shine. And it came in a brown, which I picked up the brown. And they also had black and white for sneakers. So I thought that was really nice. I hadn't seen this brand before. It's called Silver. And I thought I would give it a try. Okay, so I've noticed that the Dollar Tree is now just starting to bring out their spring stuff. I will say that I only went to one Dollar Tree. Normally, I would go to about three Dollar Trees, but it depends on where I am. And so lately, I've only been going to the one. So I think the other ones that I normally go to do have a little bit more out at the time. But um, 
since I went to this one, I did notice that they're just starting to bring their spring things out and their Easter things. So um, I noticed they had a few different spring banners. And again, I did take a few pictures. I'll insert them at the end. But I did pick up this one because it is a felt banner. And I love felt banners. And I just thought this one was really pretty. It says spring, and I just love the color. So I picked this one up. And then they had a few newer decor pieces that I hadn't seen yet. These were the first, and these are really nice. I like including these with a gift. I think they're just a nice little piece to set out on a table or if you have a shelf. And I loved all four of them, so I did pick up one of each. The first one here I thought was super cute. Bless our home. And I just love the colors and the little house with the wreath on the door. Very cute. This one was really nice for the laundry room. Wash, dry, fold, and repeat. This one with plants. Keep life simple. And then the last one, which again, I said I loved all of them, but this one was probably my favorite. And hopefully this is the beginning of lemon things arriving at the Dollar Tree. Last year we did not get the, well we haven't received them yet, the lemon plates that I seen hauled in the US and that so many of you were so kind to tell me that you would send them to me. Um, but it would be neat to see them arrive here in Canada this year. But I was happy to pick this up and I love the saying, when life gives you lemons, make something sweet. So I thought that was really nice as well. The next decor item that was new to my Dollar Tree and I was super excited to come across are these houses that have these um, characters inside that are more up front from the back of the it seems like a shadow box but it doesn't have the glass on the front but I love each and every one of them I remember seeing these houses hauled not these particular ones but houses hauled um, in the US Dollar Tree hauls but I think they were open in the back I can't quite remember but I don't ever recall seeing them here at my Dollar Trees I don't know if we ever did get those in Canada but these definitely were a really nice find. So here you can see what I mean. The fox here is set up front from the back and I just think they are adorable. I believe they are MDF. I'm not quite sure if the outside here is wood. No, it's. I believe it's. Um, it says MDF on the back. I don't know if that's just the backing or the whole thing, but it really is nice. It's in like a wood finish. And so here the fox says, stay clever little fox, which is super cute. The second one says, be a flamingo in a flock of pigeons. So cute. The unicorn here says, believe in magic. And then the last one that I picked up says home sweet home with the arrow and the cactus, which is set up front here. So I thought these were super cute. And again, I just love little pieces like this because they really look nice set in a tray, um, on a table, a three tiered tray, or even on a shelf. I just think they make really, really nice uh, pieces to change up seasonally or keep them, you know, just keep them up all year long. I think they're super, super cute. I almost forgot these in the box. Um, these are also decor that I found today, which I was really happy to come across. They are ceramic decor pieces that are shaped like puzzle pieces. And there were four different ones, so I picked up one of each. The first says, Save by Grace. Ephesians 2 8 this one says have faith God is with you the third God will make a way and the fourth I am with you always 
Matthew 28 20. I absolutely love these. The last items are pretty much all beauty related other than these wipes. These were in the baby aisle and I had not seen these wipes before and they are really nice wipes. Um, it says microbiologically tested dermatol... No, I can't say it. Vitamin E enriched. You get 80 wipes in here, uh, 80 cushion thick wipes, and I just thought they were really nice. Um, they are alcohol free and extra soft. So I actually just wanted to get some wipes to wipe my hands after shopping. So these I hadn't seen before and they really seem nice. They are only fresh wet wipes, alcohol free. So after that, I was in the beauty aisle and I was so pleasantly surprised to, surprised to come across these next items. So these are Lux by Mr. Bubble, Daydream Shower Cream, Original Bubble with Jojobe and Shea Butter. Forgive me if I said that wrong. So I love the packaging on this, really nice. And the other one that I saw was in Sparkling Sorbet. Then they had two different bath bombs. The first is Pink Color Burst Inside. And then the second one is Blue Color Burst Inside. Now is there Sweet and clean bath bomb. No, that's all it says. Original, ba original bubble bath bomb. So I guess that's what it would be called. Yeah, and then this one was sweet and clean bath bomb. And then in that same line, I thought this was pretty cool. It seems like a chocolate bar wrapped in its wrapper and it says guilt-free cocoa butter bar. Original, butter, original Bubble Cocoa and Shea Butter Ultra Moisturizing Bath Melt. A luxury bath treat. So these would be really nice to give as a gift. I thought these were really, really nice. So I'm happy to come across those. And then I seen these Scrub and Butter Body Bar by Halu. And it says 95% naturally derived on the go TSA 12 uses. So sea salt citrus, silky clean with seaweed and cocoa butter. And it's 3.7 ounces. So that was the first one. And then the second one is island hibiscus with flower petals and shea butter. So uh, these are really nice and I do think I am going to wrap these up for a gift. I was really, really happy to find the things that I did find. It wasn't a whole lot, but it still was a good shopping day at the Dollar Tree. So guys, that'll do it for this Dollar Tree haul. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a thumbs up, share the video, and if you haven't subscribed to my channel, I would absolutely love and appreciate it if you did. As always, you guys take care of yourselves, and I hope to catch you in my next video. Bye-bye.